So you guys, welcome back. Uh, today's lesson we are looking at direct variation. Last time we are looking at inverse variation. So if it is the first time you are joining us, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification bell so the next time you may see the new update. Uh, so let's get started. Uh, we are given given that y varies direct as x squared. That y is equal to 48 when x equals 4. Find the equation connecting y and x. Solution 1. Solution 1. This is for 1a. Uh, we are taught to find the equation which is connecting y and x. We are told that uh, x it is the squared and the y. So it would be y varies direct as uh, x squared multiplied by k which is a constant so y it will be equals to k multiplied by x squared uh, y it is 48 and x it is 4, 4. so let's substitute where there is the uh, y and the x so in which it will be where there is y we have uh, 48 equals to k for x squared, for x we have 4 with square, which is uh, 48 equals k. Here we have 16. Then when we divide both sides by, uh, we want k to be the subject of the formula. So we by 16 both sides, in which we remain with the k equals uh, 16 into 48 it is 3 so let's write down the equation which they are saying which they are connecting um, y and x so the equation it would be y equals uh, we have found that k it is 3 so it would be 3 x squared so, so this is the equation which they are talking about uh, for b uh, we are told that they are given that p is proportional to q cubed and that p is equal to 500 when q equals 5. Express p in terms of q. So for you to uh, express p in terms of q, you have to uh, consider this uh, kind of proportion. This kind of proportion here, it is a direct proportion. In which it will be p is direct proportional to uh, q cubed multiplied by k. In which we are going to have p equals uh, k q cubed so here we are told that uh, p is 500 500 for k we don't have q we have 5 uh, 5 cubed in which we are going to have uh, 500 equals uh, 500 equals 1.5 K, we divide both sides because we are looking for a constant. We divide both sides by 1.5. 1.5. So, K now it will be equals to uh, 1.5 into 500. We are going to have 4. 4 here. Question say express P in terms of Q. So, we have to express P in terms of Q, in which uh, the expression it will be. Uh, P equals uh, where this K we are going to put uh, 4 Q cubed. So this is an expression number 2A. So for find the value of P when Q equals minus 3. So for B, this is for number 2B. So we have to use the same formula. P equals uh, Q cubed K. Then it uh, P equals Q cubed, we are told that it is uh, minus 3 cubed, then K we have multiplied by 4, we have found 4 here, in which it will be P equals uh, negative 3 cubed, it is minus 27 multiplied by 4. So, negative 27 multiplied by 4 is 108. So this is our final answer. Thank you for watching.